Hey there, good afternoon. Greetings from Carhead Station, just off the main corridor here in central Jakarta. The train I got out of right there already stopped at the next station, which is Sudirman Baru or Station BNE City, which, well, basically sticks to Carhead Station. And after that station, there's another one, it's called Sudirman Station, which is Two, three hundred meters away from the next station you see here, so Mambaro station. Um, what's more fun is that you can actually walk all these train stations because there is a new pathway along the canal here. Let's see how that works. So today, instead of taking the train to more stations, we're going to walk those two more stations. If the sun is not too hot like today, it's actually a pretty pleasant walk. You'll see that it most likely is pretty quiet there. We'll figure out soon enough. Before we do that, I'm going to buy a drink. Let's head out of the station while well, there is another train incoming. Could catch that outside. That's a lot of noise for a train station. And crossing. the way on the tour. So the right left and the left again. Yeah, oh well, yeah. Straight away we entered uh, the restroom zone. Behind us it's still really noisy from the traffic. But ahead of us is about 700 meters of pedestrian walkway. This pathway is finally finished now. They were constructing it from the other end for quite some time. They've put up a bicycle parking as well there now. I haven't seen that one operational, so let's take a look at that. That's a really nice tree, this one. It looks amazing. Look at the tree bark. I think these trees have been here for a long time, not nearly planted. And we are walking in between skyscrapers and office buildings. Right across the street is the very well-known Sangrila Hotel with the apartments to the left of it. And the building in the distance is the BNE building. That's why this station is named BNE City. That's the only reason. This is what I meant. This is the end of um, Karet Station. Right over there. And the platform is ending there as well. The prayer platform. And this concrete is the start of BNE City station. This station was built to mainly to only serve um, airport trains every 20 minutes or so. But ever since the pandemic they haven't been running every 20 minutes. It's more like half an hour and sometimes one hour and sometimes even one and a half hours. And they decided that it was a good idea to use this for commuter trains as well. Well that is a good decision. But they should have probably closed down uh, Kata Station behind us. Um, there is a walkway here, so why not? And probably here you can cross the river if you want to make a car park or drop-off zone. Perfectly possible. Uh, that's my opinion, of course. This is uh, 
being a station. We can not enter it from this side, oddly enough. We can only enter it by walking all the way up to the main road, then turn left and walk a little bit back again. I'm not sure why it is, because this side has no access to this train station, nor has it access to Kara station or Sudir Mambaru station. There's no trees here, so of course it's uh, hot now. Fortunately, not raining. The first part of this pathway ran from that main road where you can see the cars in the distance to 10 meters from where I am now. It stopped. As you can see, the different side of concrete. It stopped right here. And there was no way to go anywhere. You could only walk back from here. So that was a useless piece of uh, walkway. Unless you want to go fishing, but I don't think you really want to go fishing in this canal. Now, it should be open. I said it was open, but the thing is, I'm not 100% sure, so I don't see anyone walking here. Fun thing is, I parked my car right on the second floor here. As I have places to go later on. Very convenient parking place here on the concourse level of the train station. Those benches are growing in the bushes now. Let's see what this is. Small stairs. Yeah, I don't think this is a parking structure for bikes though. You do see the trains from here. Pretty cute. Right over there is the main road. And yeah, that means you can actually walk in between three stations. But this is only the second station. So I'm going to show you the third station you can walk to. Yeah, you can see people walking there as well. They probably have arrived from the airport train. That's closed. That's not really convenient. <laughs> okay, it's not open yet. That's clear. Um, what I'm going to do, I can jump here. That's what I'm going to do. That's pretty silly. So I've jump this area here because I'm not going to walk all the way back for this construction site which is I don't know JXB what is it? looks like a toilet yes oh that's a Japanese style toilet with those class panels that will become opaque once you are in it but it's not open yet. To buy a ticket for it. 5,000 rupees. 30 cents, 35 cents. That's really strange. It is basically finished. But it's just not open yet. Thought it was a bicycle parking, but that's not the case. We have made it here to the end of the Suriman. Baru station or being the city station and right under this tunnel you'll officially walk into Sudirman station which becomes more obvious across the road there and to get to that side you have to do a little detour so you can't walk below it so look at the circle to make a little circle here to get down and then end up here take the tunnel and then you can the station so yes you can walk to all three stations but it's not recommended at the moment let's see 
think it's enough walking for now. See you in another video very soon. Traffic is dense there. Look, it's just a Saturday.